hi guys welcome back to my channel um i'm today i'm gonna show you a very fast video i'm trying to edit it before the hurricane gets here for who doesn't know i live in florida and we have irma coming straight to us so i don't know when i'm gonna be able to put a video so i'm gonna show this wall decoration then scrabble pieces then it's really cool and I got like a six by eight and asked them to cut in pieces six by six, but actually it's not really six by six, it's five by five, but we work it fine. And then I'm just gonna do this um the making look old with the wood finishing and I'm using the classic gray. So you get a little piece of fabric and you go all over it. But before you start painting, don't forget to sand the edges too. We did that. Actually, my husband did that. I'm just uh, the painting part. So you're just gonna put your cloth there, get the excess off, and then you go over the whole thing. There's different colors. I like gray because my house is if you watch my channel, it's black and white. So I didn't want anything too brown, but I didn't want to lose the brown of the wood because then it will not look like a scrabble piece. So I got this classic gray and that works fine. It's wet now, but when it dries, you can see the veins of the the wood and everything else. So that's cool. If you're not um, in my Instagram, yeah, it's a dash, uh, Cupping cakes gonna go there because then I can explain to you when I can come back what's going on with the hurricane and all that. So I left all my pieces drying for overnight and then kind of got lighter after the dear dryer. So now I'm just using this paper, it's the carbon paper. I don't know, a transfer paper you guys have here. You just put it on the top and you're gonna need to print the font for the scrabble pieces, the size of your um, wood. So I just tap, typed Google on um, my computer and put a Scrabble pieces font and then you can get it and download for free. And what I did, I print, I tried to print as big as I wanted to be on the pieces I did. So my pieces is five by a five and a half by six inches. So my my letters should be a little bit smaller because I want you to have the number and everything. I printed the whole alphabet and I can reuse the letters more than once. So you not need to print the whole, you know, all the names that you're making. It just like one each and you can keep it. Um, I not mistaking, I have 72 or 75 letters. And for home and um, for love, my O is a heart. Then I forgot to videotape because I decided to do when I was painting the O's. But instead, you can change all your O's for hearts if you want to. But I just switched the heart for love and um, for love and what home. So now with the acrylic paint and black, I'm gonna go over that tracing that we did i'm gonna paint all the letters one by one it sounds like a lot of work but it was actually actually pretty fun i did that in one day and um that i really enjoy it and they sell this uh, scrabble pieces painted already for you at etsy for seven dollars a piece sometimes so you can definitely make it it's not hard you just need to be patient and go over the lines and all that so if you mess it up like it did now just clean before it's wet and go over and you did it again just go you know slow and steady and try to make as like straight as possible and kind of try to get a brush that fits in your letters and your numbers because it's very important to that work that you so I'm sorry if I don't place any videos next week. I live in Melbourne, so we're not gonna get straight hit by the hurricane, but um, we don't really know if it's gonna come through the water, or it's gonna come through the middle of Miami and come up. So I don't know if I'm gonna lose powers. We have all the shutters up already. Everything is protected and we have water, we have food for all the kids. And thanks for everybody that sent me messages and we are fine. Now we're just waiting for Sunday morning to see how bad it's gonna be. So as soon as I can give a little, you know, sign if I have um, batteries and everything, I will post on Instagram to say that everything is fine and I will start putting my videos back up as soon as I can. And that's it, I think. I hope 
you know, everything is going to be fine. I'm from Brazil, so I'm a little scared about the, like hurricanes, but um, we are prepared. So I hope everybody in Miami is safe because they probably going to get the worst part of it. And that's it. I just wanted to let you know, guys know that's why it's not going to have videos or we will have videos let's see how it's gonna be i hope i will be able to do to make videos for you guys and everything's gonna be fine so we're just gonna finish all the letters and you um, don't need to do two layers i just give one and let it dry you can put a varnish in the top but since mine's gonna be inside i didn't even bother because i didn't want it to be too i like glossy i want it to look like the scrabble pieces are like woody and really like natural. But since I wanted to make more gray, so I was already changing the color of the wood. I didn't want to put any other layer on top of it. So that's why I'm going to keep without anything. And then with a little liner um, brush, you go over your numbers. If you guys was wondering how I put it then all on the wall, I did with the like four pieces of the really good double side tape and they are fine you know they have been there for a while like a week more a little bit more and nothing <laughs> is falling and they look very steady so that will be perfect it's not that heavy but be a uh, patient when you're putting in the wall too because you want to be like you know line up and not that look pretty as you can be but i really liked it it looks really cool on the wall and as a detail then you made it for your home you can have all the important names we have the kids names the pets names um the only then words that are not named on my wall it's family and home and love and as i said before home and love there's a heart instead of the o and you guys can see that and it's pretty cool so i hope you guys can you guys can do that and make that for your house if you have one wall then you don't know what to do that's kind of pretty cool so now is all my letters here then i, I let it dry a little bit and when they do something else and now here in the wall so i have all the kids names and the love on the heart you guys can see that oh it's a heart and the papa red kind of gave a little life to the wall too and i really like it i hope you guys like it and we'll talk to you guys soon after this hurricane um wish us luck and i talk to you guys soon bye